Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 25th, okay? So we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for around the 25th? Now keep in mind the timing is fluid. Typically these readings play out for me in the next few days, but the timing is always fluid. I get comments from people that go through ones that were done weeks ago and say they were say they resonate. You know, they, they do the little thing where they go through the daily vibe and they pick one, they watch, and they say, oh, that was for me, whatever. Anyhow, so what do we have for a message today? Two of Pentacles reversed. We have something that is a little off. There's something that is unplanned that is happening. Ooh, something about a commitment, a get-together, a gathering. There could be an offer or an invite that is coming. You don't see it coming. Ten of Wands reverse. Now that is opening up, letting go of something. This is uh, making a conscious change. This is happiness. It is commitment. Building a foundation. Getting together. Having fun. Somebody's going to be attending a get together. I feel like there's an offer or an invite that is coming. Ooh. Eight of Pentacles reversed. High Priestess reversed. Emperor. We have an emperor here in the future. This is somebody that is very organized, very structured, very wise, has a lot of life experience. This is a protector that is very decisive, that is making a decision. We have a decision maker, somebody that is in a position of authority that is taking charge in the future. They are... I feel like something is coming that you didn't see coming. I feel like we have an individual that is um, taking responsibility or just basically taking ownership or doing something. This is somebody that is taking the position and there's a total lack of awareness. Five of Swords reverse. That is a, there's some sort of peace or resolution peaceful resolution but that eight of pentacles is something not working out not trying not putting in effort not even working out not trying not trying totally unaware not not even having to do anything for it it's very odd the ten of i just feel like the energy is something that's coming that it's easy it's a very easy situation because there's a person here that is doing the work, that is putting in the effort, that is making the decision. This is somebody that is um, very strong, experienced, um, making a change because of that Ten of Wands reversed. That is, that is uh, making a conscious change. But that high priestess reverse is lack of awareness. There's a secret that is about to be revealed. Somebody, something is about to be revealed. And it's about an, a commitment. It's about a commitment or a relationship or a foundation with that four of wands. Somebody's going to be getting an offer or an invite from an individual that is very experienced this person is a protector or they're in a position of authority could be a boss but there is some sort of uh, decision that is being made this person is very very put together has a plan in a position of powerful I mean of power I was gonna say this person is powerful but is it definitely in a position of power That two of pentacles reverse though is some sort of I don't know if it's financial loss or poor planning. 
there's been some sort of conflict. Maybe it's financial conflict. But this is the end of a conflict. I believe that there's a conflict that is ending. There's a resolution. Somebody could be working with somebody and it leads to a commitment. Ah, an offer or an invite is coming. I knew that it was. I knew that it was. I was, I was positive that it was happening. Somebody is going to be getting an offer or an invite that it they don't they totally don't see it coming. This is going to be maybe they get invited out on a date or they get invited to a get together or a party or a reunion or something like that. There is a, there's, something is about to burst into your world that is very well suited. That is, that is a new spark. It's a new desire. It's something that happens very suddenly. This is exciting. This is a new adventure. It's going in a new direction. It's very positive, good news. There's been some sort of struggle. The struggle is over. There may have been some indecis indecision or some, uh, well, obviously there's been some sort of struggle, but I feel like the struggle is over. I feel like a decision is being made. I think it's a very easy choice. It's a very easy decision. There's a change that is coming. A huge weight is about to be lifted. This is a relief there's some sort of relief that is coming with that Ten of Wands reversed. Definitely good news. I feel a very playful energy as well. Hangman reversed. That is opening up, letting go. Somebody has been alone. They may have been sacrificing themselves. I feel like they've been could become enlightened and they're ready to fight for something. This is somebody, the emperor is battle ready, you know, ready to fight at a moment's notice. Done wasting time, done being alone. Somebody doesn't want to be alone anymore. And because the high priestess and the upright is alone and the hangman is alone. I feel like we got somebody here who doesn't want to be alone anymore. They're looking for a commitment. They're looking for a relationship. They have this new desire. <clears throat> and I feel like they're taking action towards it. I feel like we have a masculine energy that is taking action. Cups reversed. Now the Ten of Cups reversed is no relationship, relationship problems, unhappiness. But we do have a new opportunity here. Somebody has not been focusing on a relationship. They've been inflexible. They have not been flexible. They've been struggling with letting go because the hangman's about letting go. They've been letting go of something, but I feel like now they're ready for a commitment and they're looking for a commitment. Letting go of a relationship that they were hanging on to. Letting go of a relationship that they were hanging on to. And I feel like it's because they have a new desire, a new spark, a new flame. Something that they are attracted to. There's a new a loved attraction here, I believe. Six of Pentacles reversed. Now that is uh, lack of harmony, one-sidedness. Lack of reciprocation. Somebody was in a relationship that they didn't get re reciprocation. They didn't get what they deserved. Somebody didn't put in effort. They didn't. There's been an abuse of power here. 
somebody was conned, you know. There could be some theft, I mean, stolen from. I wonder if somebody was stolen from. There's definitely been some secret. Secret is about to be revealed about a relationship. There is. I don't know whose message that is for. There could be some punishment that is coming as well. I just got to be honest um, with that hangman underneath the Ten of Cups reverse. Hangman in reverse could be punishment. We have somebody here that is obsessed. They are obsessed with control. They steal. Or they lie or something like that. And um, I don't know if somebody is losing a job or they've lost a job or... They've done something abusive. Somebody is going to be receiving a message. <sighs> There's some sort of poor planning here as well. It's very interesting. Two of Pentacles reverse, six of Pentacles reverse, eight of Pentacles reverse. There's not qualified. We got somebody here that may have gotten themselves in a relationship where the other person wasn't qualified for the job. They may have been very secretive. There's secrets here. There is some secrets here. There's some sort of uh, secretive individual here who keeps secrets. But I feel like that relationship is over because the Ten of Cups is reversed. No longer giving any type of energy to that relationship that they were hanging on to. And I feel like they're not putting any more effort into that relationship that they were hanging on to because there's another option here. There's all there's two choices. And I feel like a decision is being made. I feel like it is a decision is being made to remove themselves from the conflict, from the struggle, and not look back. I feel like this is a conscious change to drop that burden. Because I feel like there's a there is a new suitor. That's what the page of sword or the page of wands is a new suitor that is better suited. We I think that we have somebody here, and I just looked on the bottom. Four of Cups reverse. That is interested. That's a new love interest. So there is. There's a new love interest here. And somebody has been moping and crying over something in the past, probably a third party situation, but now they're interested. Now they're interested in an opportunity that is right in front of their face. This is seizing the new opportunity, letting go of regrets, the end of stagnation. It's looking forward now. Somebody's going to be getting together with a new suitor that is better suited for them after they've been in a relationship where there was a lack of equality, there was a lack of give and take, there was, uh, there was a fraud or a con man or something like that. Somebody has abused their power. I feel like there's a new opportunity here with an individual that is very uh, protective, uh, decisive, responsible, noble, and ready. This person is ready. They're, they're ready and they're, they're ready. They're ready for a commitment. They're ready for a new suitor. They're ready for some passion in their lives and love. So anyway, I do believe there is somebody that is looking at something very, very attractive and they are about to make a move. They've been alone. I see alone here. They've been wasting time, sacrificing, you know, over a previous relationship, not getting any kind of, getting crumbs maybe, or not getting anything. This is letting go. It is letting go of that relationship. It is. In committing to something new. So I think there's an offer or an invite here that leads to commitment. And it happens easily. It's a very easy, it's almost like it's an easy transition. I think it's unplanned. I think it happens suddenly. Good luck.